Hello, Alan. You've got your microphone now. You're not well, well, floor, well, well, you? Here we are again, everybody. <laughs> hey, Dom and Dumber. <laughs> Indeed. But well, hey, just a minute. Well, just, let me put my microphone down just for a wee minute. Here, I'll hold it. Here, yeah, John. Yeah, go. Hold it. Look yeah, after I've got it. Got it. Yeah. Uh, if How you know, does that look on a Monday morning? Unbeaten. And the only team in the league to be unbeaten. Okay, I know. I did not have less time or be Manchester City. Hang on a minute, John. I'm just, I'm just putting God's time away. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. right, what are you, what are you on about? Go on. Well, let's talk about uh, Stoke because uh, obviously going two goals down again, similar to Aston Villa, even though yeah. Claudio Ranieri had offered pizza for a clean sheet. Um, so that <laughs> means quite well now. I think he's going to have to offer an awful lot more than that. Well, yeah, but he looking at the goals, goal. I mean, the first goal, he, the, the, the guy's walked through the defenders, hasn't he, really? Well, he has, and, and, and I think that's, we're going, to, we're going to discuss that in more detail later on, everybody. But um, I think it was too easy. The, the goals were conceded uh, a wee bit too easy. Um, but hey, you've come away with a point, you've gone 2-0 down and you've come away with a point, two each, a bit frantic the last 20-25 minutes. But you, you, we're unbeaten in the league, we've got West Ham tomorrow night, Tuesday night. Um, big changes for that I would think. But then Arsenal, Arsenal come to our place, Leicester City, third top of the league, or it'll be fourth top. Fourth now, yeah, Stupid fourth. West Ham. Manchester City. I'm man not bothered about yeah. them. <laughs> but you know we are where we are. Not being at the top five the whole of the season. Unbeaten. We've got the same number of goals, I think, as most other teams up there. But it's the goals against Colum. Yeah, that, that's, 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 the worry, well, that's the worry for Claudio Ranieri as well. Obviously, he's tried to, you know, enthuse him into defending better by offering pizza and stuff like that. But he's got work to do there, hasn't he? And John, he you don't seriously he's going believe that he's going to take them for a pizza? Well, I don't know. I, I, I mean, that Come was on, just... Come on, for goodness sake. You're a civilian dog in there. Talk <laughs> professionally, man. A, a bit of nice rhetoric to, to go with the week. And it was quite amusing at the time. Yeah, but, and you kind of wanted it to work. But what do they need to do? Do they need to go back to the three centre backs? What do they need to do? Well, I think, John, we're going to discuss that a wee bit later. Yeah, on. This, sure. this, this first bit, really, to sort of rejoice. And maybe have a wee talk chat about the West Ham game. No, Stoke. Stoke? <laughs> yeah. Phil Stoke me is Stoke only, not West Ham, everybody. That's, That's what I don't want to be as well. I know he's Stoke. I think you're losing your mind again. Me? Yeah. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Stoke away, two each, we're still up there, uh, confidence is still sky high, the support was great. Um, we were a wee bit disappointed to go 2-0 down. I, I was in Southampton, everybody, taking the lad to uni, but we had it on. And it was, you know, to sit there and, and, and your team goes 1-0 down, you oh, no. But then you go 2-0 down. And you're thinking, well, is this going to be the one? Is this, is this the one that's going to, you know, in the first defeat of the season? Is it going to happen? But no, we don't give up because we've got goals. We have got goals. We have got attacking options that are as good as any, for me, any team in the, pre in the Premiership. You look at all, all around the Premiership, we have got pace to, but we've got the three quickest players in the, the Premiership. And I tell you what, the ones that are just behind them, they too sloppy either. But we've got goals. We've got options up front. We've got good players up front. We need to stop licking them at the back. Yeah, and uh, obviously the system he's playing at the moment to an extent was obviously kicked in big time second half. Vardy with that excellent second goal and the penalty. We're going to talk a bit more about Danny Drinkwater as well, aren't we, later on. But, you know, um, Mario's taking a good penalty too. Yeah, I'm surprised he put it in the same side, to be honest with you. Mm. You know, that's the same side as he put his last one in, and the goalkeeper ought to have done his homework and maybe taken a chance and, you know, gone to that side where, where uh, Ryan put his last, his last penalty. But then it went, uh, with a plum, as they say, and uh, then Jamie outstrips them all, and a lovely side foot finish, by the way. Lovely. Jamie Vardy worked on his right side, and it's that open your body up, play it with the instep. Beautiful. Sees the goal, he might have lashed it. He might have smashed it. He's maturing, he's growing. He's had a couple of trips at home and abroad with the international team. And he's probably watched your Roonies of this world, the way they stick the ball in the net. And he's learning, he's learning fast. And he's, he's becoming an even better player. 
But away from home, a point, you'd always take a point anyway. But you kind of wondered if we were going to do another Aston Villa, how would we get a winner? But I'd be satisfied with a point from that. Well, absolutely. Away from home, a point is great. No matter where you go, you go, you set up to win the game. But if you don't, it's at my phone thing, or is it yours? Not mine. Not yours? Must be mine. Anyway, we got him striking again, won't we? We have a scholar. Anyway, no. <laughs> I'm only kidding, John. You believe that, don't you? Yeah. No, but yeah, um, the, 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 the whole team, the whole ethic, everything that's going on at the club now is just so positive. Um, and, and we have something to hold on to as well, John. We are unbeaten. We are the only unbeaten team in the Premiership on merit. You know, it's not a fluke, it's not, a, it's not luck or anything like that. If any bit of luck's come in, we've made, it, we've made our own luck. But um, let, let's enjoy it. Everybody enjoy it. Everybody stay together and enjoy this. Because we've got these games coming up. We've got a big one on Saturday against Arsenal. Which we'll come to again in a minute. I've got a few things to say about that. But uh, enjoy it. It's great. It's lovely to watch your team. It's lovely to watch your supporters. Getting so much joy out of their team again, John. You know that they've maybe not had for, for, for too long a time. Yeah, good time to be a Leicester fan. Uh, more of the games to come later on.